How have you been? All are healthy and energetic, isn't it? Say it loudly. We are energetic. We are healthy. Yes, that's my kids. Shh. Why do you all suddenly get silent? Yes, that was my action, isn't it? Ah, uh, teacher shows the action to keep quiet. Now, look at this. What is this one? Ah, uh, it's a question mark. We used it to indicate questions. Now, what is this? It's a wrong mark. Excellent. We all are familiar with this wrong mark. Now, what is this, kids? Yes, it's tick, is it? When something is right or true, we use this tick mark to indicate that. Now, what is this, students? What it indicates? Ah, uh, this is a horn and a cross mark on that. What is this? Yes, you said it. It is no horn. Ah, uh, while you are traveling, in some places, we should not make the noise of Horns. Okay, students. So, this indicates no horn. Now, what is this? It's a traffic signal. What it indicates? Ah, the red bulb indicates to stop. Very good. You all are familiar with this. Is it, student? Some pictures or some things convey some messages to us. These things or these pictures are called symbols. What we call these? Symbols. The symbols represent or convey some message to others. We are using the no parking symbol to convey that this place is not allowed to park vehicle. And the danger symbol indicates something is danger here. We have to take more care while traveling through this place. So students, these are called symbols. Symbols are conveying some messages to others through pictures. We are Indians. You all know we are belong to the great nation India. And our nation India is a land of different kinds of people, languages, religions, customs, then festivals. And different types of dressing style. We all are belong to the nation India. And we are known as India. To show the uniqueness and culture and the heritage of India to the other nations. We also follow some symbols. They are called national symbols. Uh, you already learned it from your smaller classes. We have our own national flag, our national emblem and tiger is our national animal, peacock is our national bird, lotus is our national flower. Very good. So in today's class we are going to study about our national symbols in detail. Why we choose tiger? Why we didn't choose lion as our national animal? Have you ever think about it? Why lotus is the national flower? Why we didn't choose rose or lily or uh, some other flowers? Let's learn the reasons behind these national symbols in our today's class. Are you ready to learn the interesting facts about our national symbols? Yes, very good. Let us start with our national flag. How many colors are there in our national flag? Yes, there are three colors. Which are they? Saffron, white and green. So students, do you know each color stands for some purposes? The top band color is saffron and the saffron stands for the courage and sacrifice. Now, which is the middle color? Yes, it is white. White stands for purity. Okay, students. Something is pure. So everything belong to our nation is pure. To indicate the purity of our nation, the middle band is white. And there is a blue wheel on the middle of our white band. It is called Ashoka Chakra. And the third one, the bottom band is green in 
color and this green stand for prosperity okay students so students these three colors indicate different things that is why we adopted these colors in our national flag now let's move on to the next one that is our national emblem and our national emblem has four lions but we can see only three lions isn't it students the fourth lion is hidden at the back of the emblem so there are four lions in our national emblem and at the bottom of our national emblem it is written satyameva jayade satyameva jayade in sanskrit language so sanskrit is the oldest language of india and in sanskrit it written that satyameva jayade which means truth alone trims okay students only truth will win always and we can see this national emblem in our currencies and coins okay students all of you check it when you get the coins and currencies now you all know tiger is our national animal we all studied that lion is the king of the forest but tiger is a national animal why the tiger symbolizes the power strength elegance intelligence and alertness it has been chosen as the national animal because of its grace strength and enormous power okay so tiger is very alert and intelligent animal that is why tiger is our national animal now which is our national bird students yes peacock is our national bird it is a symbol of grace and beauty and all we love the beautiful feathers of the peacock we love these colors is it students and the peacock represents the unity of vivid colors so that is why peacock is our national bird and next one is our national flower we know lotus is our national flower because it is a sacred flower it is a symbol of purity even when its roots are in the dirtiest water and mud lotus produces the most beautiful flower and there will not be any mud or dirt in the petals of the lotus that is why lotus is our national flower students now you all know why we choose these as our national symbols and we have our national anthem and a national song which is our national anthem all of you know that ah uh, janaganamana is our national anthem ah uh, every day after the school assembly our national anthem is played and we all are used to stand still in the attention position is it students so janaganamana is our national anthem and which is our national song didn't get that Okay, Vande Madaram. Have you heard this song? Vande Madaram, Sujalam, Subhalam, Malayajashidalam. Have you heard this song before? Yes, Vande Madaram is our national song. So now we all know what is the purpose of the national symbols to show the uniqueness. culture and rich heritage of india in front of other nations we are using the the best of our nations as our national symbols so students we should respect all our national symbols we should stand in attention wherever you are hearing the national anthem we should not step on national flag or we should not show any disrespect towards the national symbols so students even though our cultures religion languages are different we all are indian and feel proud to be an indian catch you in the next class with a new topic thank you